Welcome to Introduction to GIS. You are enrolled in one of these classes, unless you've just stumbled upon this link from the internet someplace, in which case, welcome anyway. My name is Forrest Bolick. I am a senior lecturer at the University of Massachusetts Amherst, and I'm very happy to have all of these wonderful videos and lab walkthroughs and problem walkthroughs and everything that we have going about introduction to GIS. I think that GIS is something that is for everyone. Everyone can have it, everyone can use it. And so everyone should have access to it. So this is the beginning of what is essentially a full lecture series on various GIS aspects. And that's pretty exciting. All of these slides, not just this one, but all of them are Creative Commons licensed by NCSA, which means by attribution, that's me, and for non-commercial purposes and under shared alike licenses, you may use these however you see fit past those requirements. So I'm also a big believer in open GIS uh, and open education. So welcome into Introduction to GIS. Again, you're in one of those sections or you're just hanging out, that's fine too. If you're just hanging out, you, you know, this might not be the most useful video for you, but for everyone else, it should be pretty good. This is the set of recordings here for what we're calling module one of Introduction to GIS. Uh, we're gonna talk about the syllabus, do some myth busting resources, talk about the semester, the, the session i don't know what we want to call it and we'll encourage and i'll discuss how we get questions and comments dealt with so there's me again there's a more updated photo of me hey again i'm a senior lecturer uh, in geography and geographic information science and technology here at the university of massachusetts amherst department of geosciences which is now the department of earth Geographic and Climate Science, Department of Environmental Conservation. It's a lot to handle, but I've got geography degrees all the way back, back as far back as you can go. And my interests are all about GIS and geography education. So my background's in geography. I am a geographer through and through, and I'm always happy to share and discuss about GIS, about geography, spatial thinking, computational thinking, all of that good stuff. The course, the lectures, the recordings, all of these things are really grounded in making sure that we have as broad of an understanding as possible of all the different components of GIS, while at the same time going into the depth and detail needed when we have depth and detail needed. GIS can be something that's very overwhelming, that's very all-encompassing, that's very much a lot. And I choose to design the way I present GIS so that it isn't that. So hopefully each of these recordings, all of the labs, everything like that feels approachable. That's one of the big goals. And that's one of the big things that I think is the most important to have in a GIS course. So if you're enrolled in the course, you hopefully you've looked at the syllabus. It's available on our course management page on our Moodle in the cloud, our Moonami. I guess if you really want a printed copy, I could mail you one, send me an email, let me know. What I want to re-encourage you to do is to look through that syllabus and to read it and to go through the assignments and go through the course outline and go through the schedule and all that stuff. We'll talk about the schedule a little bit more in a, in a video coming up. But what's really important is for you to get a sense of what is going to happen across this entire session, across the time that we have together. After you do that review, or re-review, or third review, how many other times you've reviewed it, I want you to head to a link coming up and answer a couple questions for me. I really 
appreciate and like and want your feedback and comments and questions, everything like that throughout the semester. And we will engage on these as much as you have energy to engage with it. So that's that's it for the first video. Once you go to that link or scan that QR code, tx.ag slash GIS1, you answer these questions there. What do you need out of this course? What do you want to learn or explore? What are you worried about? First video, video one down in the course. Pretty cool, pretty sweet. Answer those questions. Links on our Moodle page. See you in the next one.